everyone. Welcome back to my channel. So, it is in the wee hours of the morning. It's like a little after six, I think. And it's uh, still dark outside here. <laughs> but uh, over the weekend, I received a package that I didn't know about because I didn't feel like going out of the house. And um, I just checked my mailbox last night and I got my second part of my order from Gareth. Yay. So, and gee, I have to tell you, I'm loving this box. So, you know, this box is going to be recycled. Yes, it will. Oh, look at the cute little card. How cute is this? Look, isn't that cute? I love all the little layers of paper you have on here. Did I see you make these? Thinking I did. I don't know. I'm telling you, I'm not with it. So, let me see what it says. If I can read it. Oh, uh, it says, to a special lady. Yep, that's you, Donikins. That's my nickname from Gareth. Here is the second part of your order. Love, G. Aw, thank you, Gareth. That's so cute. And look at all my flowers. Okay, so I'm not sure what these are called, but they're like little berry strands. Let's see, I'll take, you know if I take these out, I'm not getting them. I'm sorry, guys. I am running a little bit of fever today, so I'm, this morning I'm a little bit... Uh, Frazzle, so just forgive me. Um, oh, look at these. Little stems. Aren't those adorable? Love those. Those would make some great filler for, I mean, just great little things all around together for like a little spray, a little arrangement. Look how cute those are. Just do them different sizes. Very cute. I tell you, I have really not been disappointed with anything I got from Gareth's store, which is created home with G as well. And, um, you know, his store is closing. We're all sad, but we're excited to see what is in store for him next. And um, he's got some great sales over there, so y'all should go to create a home with G and check it out. And um, I'll link it below. But I got two of those. Oh. And then I got some wheat berry sprays. I got these lovely kind of off-white ones. Aren't those beautiful? Got two of those. And I got two of these. I was thinking I did. Yep. I got two. I, was, I think these are white. You know, I'm... They're either white or very soft lavender, but I think they're white. <laughs> um, they're little burlap flowers. Aren't those pretty? And then I got, um, I know I ordered, yep, two of each one of these. And I got them in the wine color. I got two of those. Those are so pretty. Oh, and I knew I had wish I had ordered more of these. Oh, my stinking goodness. Look how cute these roses are. Gareth, I bet you don't have none left either. Those are so cute. Look, they're pink. And then I got a purple and white spray because those are my two favorite colors, pink and lavender. And I have a lot of favorite colors, but these are my favorite ones right here. These are beautiful. They'll be nice on a project, which, by the way, you have to watch Thursday Night Live. I am going to try my best to do it this week. Um, I wanted to do a steampunk canvas, but then I decided I wanted to do something shabby. So, you know what? I'm going to combine the two and make a shabby steampunk. Don't know what that looks like, but we'll figure it out together. And I got two red wheat berries. Oh, these are so pretty, Gareth. I love them. And then I got two of the burlap flowers in the natural colors. Aren't this pretty? Oh, Gareth, you should not have. He sended me, sended me, he sent me another one of these. It reminds me of a sea urchin, and I'm not sure if that's what it is or not, but it looks like a sea urchin to me. And um, I already have one that he sent me um, last year. 
or earlier this year last year I think anyway I have one and um, this is a matching one and I plan to take some of these natural burlap flowers and put them around here and then some little shells and stuff I already like I said I already have one that matches so I'll be able to do that and then Gareth Frewer he sent me another flip flop Okay, the other one had that he sent me when my first part of my order had a little chip down there in the corner. Gareth, I told you not to worry about that. I would be um, putting a shell or something over it. But thank you so much, sweetheart. I really appreciate that. And um, so this will be, I don't know. Um, if this will be a wreath right away or not. I don't know. All right, what did you do? What's all wrapped up? Oh, my goodness. Bubble wrap for days. Oh, Gareth. Aw. Okay, so if you remember my last big order, I did it live. I just wasn't up to that today. It was just me popping bubble wrap. Um, okay. <laughs> um... He sent me the shell um, that had the little um, succulents in it, and it looked like water inside of it. Well, he sent me the clam shell when he made this time, and it, it just looks like it's got water in it the way that he did that. Um, he did it, if I'm not mistaken, with something very similar to E6000 we have here in the States. But if I can find that video, I will link it below in the description box because it shows how he did this. Um, this is so pretty. And I have, um, I'm very close to giving a home tour, maybe. You know, I've only been in here a little over a year, so. I should have done it a long time ago, but for those who don't know me, I'm very OCD about certain things, and I want things done a certain way, and if they're not done a certain way, you're not going to see them. So, um, I've been working so hard on my house and everything else, and uh, I haven't done much this weekend this past weekend because I simply did not feel good. But anyway, I have a wicker table over on the side and it has a big shell that I did last year with succulents in it. And then um, my little lighthouse bottles that Gareth gave me. And then I have some candles and some sea glass bottles with a jute that I got from Dollar Tree. And then it has the, uh, the one that looks like this. It's this color. That Gareth gave me and and now I have a matchy one and my little table is going to be complete over there it's so cute Gareth thank you so much you are such a sweetheart you did not have to do that oh but that is my the rest of my little haul so thank you so much Gareth listen guys um like I said he is closing the shop he's got some terrific wonderful sales on right now Please go over there and check it out. Help him out. He has to sell everything, and um, which I cleared him out if I had money, but, you know, <laughs> that wasn't feasible. So do me a favor and go check out what's left in the store. See if he can get you something. Like I said, he's got good deals on right now. And if you saw my first video, you know what a haul I had. <laughs> so, um... Anyway, thank you so much, Gareth. I really appreciate your generosity and always sharing with me. One of these days, I promise, either you're going to be here or I'm going to be there, but I'm going to give you a big old southern hug. So thanks a lot, and thank you guys for watching. I will see you all later on. Um, uh, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> later on uh, tomorrow for our Dollar Tree Tuesday haul. Um, and I, even though I'm filming this before my Monday morning coffee, it probably won't come out to after I do Monday morning coffee live. So, all right, guys, have a great afternoon. Pray for me. Then I'll keep it all together um, today with the kiddos and stuff and not feeling well. But anyway, thanks, guys, for being so supportive. I'll see you all later. Bye.